Good afternoon. This is Pam. Follow your brush. This is a day to play, which is what I'm doing. Having so much fun. I have been working with my A Gallo paints I showed you yesterday. This is the Earth set. I didn't. Sh we didn't paint with those. The Earth set yesterday. We painted with the Essential Six. My cool primaries and my warm primaries, secondary primaries. But today, this is from the Earth set, and I have been having the best time playing with these paints because that's what I do. I'm just, I'm an addict. I'm addicted to water and paint. I'm going to squirt some water on here and just show you what these paints have been doing that have had me so thrilled today. No particular order of spray or anything like that. I'm just coming straight into my pan. Look there, I'm not even using my, I'm not even using my mixing bowl. I'm just coming straight in and letting this paint do what it wants. And these colors, just slap it on. Just slapping it on and letting it run. <laughs> When I first started painting, I would watch you tutorials and I would see some painters that would just get in front of their easel and they were just throwing the paint up there. And I was like, oh my gosh, what are they doing? And look at me now, four or five years later, painting with watercolor and just slapping it on. But look what it's doing. It's pretty. It's, it's running in these beautiful, beautiful textures. And, and and these colors are just magnificent. They almost look granulating to me, if you see that. This is a burgundy. I know there's no rhyme or reason, and don't, don't panic, don't panic. If you're watching me, don't panic, okay? I'm just throwing these on here, and I may even spritz some more. We're just gonna let these go and do and see what they wanna do. Um, I just love doing that. I see a forest scene maybe emerging. I don't know. I don't know what it's gonna tell me. Um, I talk to my paints and my paintings. Do you talk to yours? I talk to mine and they talk back. <laughs> they tell me stop what you're doing and get a grip. And then sometimes they tell me that, yay, I like what you just did. Uh, so I'm just playing here, um, which is what I like to do. We might get some trees in here. I don't know. I don't really want to think too much. I just want to let this go and, and, and let it do what it wants to do. I got another color I haven't put on here yet. It's this one down here. It's kind of a, it's a softer pink. It's pretty. Let's do something over here. It's a little damp. You put these two together. Just let them run. I'm using my uh, Kilimanjaro notebook. It's 140 pound, 100% cotton paper from uh, Cheap Joe's. Coming in straight to the pigment colors, right from the pan. Uh, watered it down. Splish splash. I got some more of this over here. And I know this really probably isn't making any sense, but I am loving it actually as I'm looking at this. Add some more of this Ross, I think it's Ross Sienna. Yeah, Ross Sienna. This is pretty. I'm gonna add some of this right here. And then let me show you what I've seen. I don't know what you're seeing other than a mess, but I am seeing some stuff here. If I turn this this direction, I'm seeing a beautiful landscape. 
a sky, a nice moody sky. I can come down here. I could bring some tree shapes in here after it dries. I don't know. It just to me, it's just beautiful, and it's it's still wet, so it's still going to be running and going different directions. I don't want to do too much while it's still wet because I don't want to start getting a lot of blooms and runs, but I'm just having a wonderful time with this paint. So I just wanted to share that with you really quickly. A Gallo, the Earth 6 set. Um, we can go any way we want with this. I kind of like it on the other side, like that, like I just showed you. Since we're being bold, I'm gonna spritz it with my little spritzer. See what else movement we can have come about. These colors really um, seem like they're almost granulating. I'm, I'm just loving the movement. I'm gonna let that come down this way some more. Can you see it running? Just let it play together. I love that. I'm gonna let this dry as a first wash. I'm gonna leave it alone for now. Just got a puddle down here. I'm gonna blot that up. I'm just gonna let it run and dry and let the colors play together and I think it's just gorgeous. And I hope you enjoyed that for a little mini, mini playtime with my A Gallo paints from Assisi, Italy. I'm gonna go this way again because I really like that didn't coming down this direction. And I think I might make it a landscape. I don't know. After it dries, I might go this way and just add some details, or I may just um let it be what it wants to be, which is gorgeous. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you like to follow along with my little playful adventures. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye.